Thank you so much, viewer, for listening to me here today. Today, I'll discuss and talk about Siemens PLC module and uh, terminal modules. What is the terminal modules? What is the function of it? And uh, how to replace terminal modules? This is most important for everyone, automation engineers, that how we actually replace it. And uh, you can see the picture in here and details of the terminal block in here. I'll show you step by step in details. You can see the picture. This is the uh, module uh, point of this stage module and this is the connection point terminal. You can see the picture in here, the eight channel module, terminal module in here. I'm just showing you. I'm just mentioning in here the four terminal module here because I have the four terminal problem in my system. So I want to change four module in my systems. So for the reason, I'm just purchasing four module, terminal module and replacing the present and the uh, faulty one. You can see the picture in here. So please uh, stay with me to finish the, stay with me until finish the video. Otherwise you cannot understand in details. First of all, I'll describe and talk about terminal module. That means base connector of the PLC. This is Siemens brand terminal modules and type of these models, uh, 6 s 70139 and 4CB20 and 00 and T02. And here I'll put the DI module for your better understanding. You can see the picture in here, how I put the module and how I remove the module from the terminal modules. Or base connections and now I'll show you how to open the terminal modules from the picture you can see now at bottom side of the module are the locking system for fixing in control panel you can see now I have removed the lock and open the terminal modules you can see I already opened this and look at the picture every Korealy uh, this is very uh, this is bus communications uh, I'm just mentioning it here for indication indications and this one is uh, this one is bus communications and this one is 24 volt common and this one is for another one is a locking so locking system for the fixing it properly with the terminal modules and now you can see again fix it how is it time fix it you can see this is very simple yeah you can see i'll just fix it properly this is very simple but to do it very carefully this is most important, how I replace, how I open, and this and that. So thank you so much for this module system. And I'm just going to the next step for the real scenario of the PLC control picture. How I replace the terminal modules and I'm given hardware connections after replacing. So that is the thing my, uh, my students, uh, main theme. So the terminal, you can see the picture in here. I already started the replacing work and given hardware, hardware connections. I'm just open faulty one uh, PLC module, digital input module, and just putting the terminal module and the given the hardware connection from the one by one eight channel connection. Open the connection and uh, put in the new one connections. I replace four digital input module base because all my system is now doing malfunctioning due to the terminal block is problem. So maybe terminal module inside the mechanical portion damage or sometimes doing it on off conditions because of the installation age of that the PLC module is more than the 10 years. We can see the picture here. I'm just putting the module for the after replacing uh, after all other conditions completed. You can see the picture in here. I'm just slightly swept this period because I need to open another one. You can see I'm just oh, another one open for design good module because this one also is a problem. For the design, I'm just replace the base. And again, put this one and I'm just again connection, hardware connection started. So for that reason, maybe something is happening inside the terminal module because 
is also the 10 years back i'm just in, installing this this terminal module you can see the picture how i removed and how i again fixing with the full channel step by step i have to change the four module that was problematic you can see how it how i paste in directly with the channel full these are connected for bus connections you can see yes now the fully connected with the system now i'm just open how to remove the, you can see they're very simple i was just open from the channel systems but this one is faulty one i'm just remove this one and again put the new one this one is connection point you can see here this is the bus connection how i put in these connections uh, how i yes this is the bus connections this is the login systems for your better understanding i'm just seeing it several times you can this one is uh this is the last one i need to open and give the hardware connections and finally i need to open the in cover you can see this is the last one because uh, total i have I, I have to i change already three and now this one is the fourth one digital module terminal block so this is the last one we can see very carefully you must to uh, see the video full video otherwise you cannot understand the detailing of this one you can see the picture now i'm just open the faulty one and the in cover module of the terminal module without in cover you cannot run the program because the program showing you the uh, hardware connection faults you can see i'm just putting the yes this one I, i'm just putting in in cover to the main system which has to replace the program uh, which has replace the uh, in cover of this terminal block i'm just putting in here you can see Oh, there is some problem so now the pudding is very carefully okay, okay this finally is perfectly fitted with the systems after fully change the uh, terminal block now I, I given the power and check the machine running conditions you can see that everything is good looks good also you can see the the, the uh, faulty one I'm just remove the from the floor first this is you can see that everything is good looks good you cannot my problem is solved thank you for listening to me cordially and uh, if you were first in my channel requested to you please subscribe my channel thank you thank you for listening to me here today thank you